very flexible for anything, if it's personal or you just like want to take a weekend off. It doesn't matter what it is. Whatever your situation, they will accommodate whatever you need and there's no questions asked. It's just notify them when you need off and they will make it happen. You're in a man's industry, so therefore a lot of the ICIs are males. So having a female ICI softens the environment in the truck and you can relate a lot more on their level and tell them how, what you experience on the road and how it is, and what to watch for and what not to watch for and just be safe out there on your own if you are an, a, a single driver as a female with protocols to take. Being an ICI driver, you can get fall into a lot of bad habits that you're not familiar with and you don't want to transfer it on to a student so you have to like slow down and you know stop being complacent and start you know doing everything to the T to follow everything to the safety protocol and so that way you can teach them correctly. Uh, the roaring part of being ICI is probably get them getting out of the truck with a big smile on their face and knowing that they, they have the confidence to go out on their own and you know they can do it. It's just that confidence and you know that smile on their face that you, you did a good job. Because I've gone through the program too so therefore I'm familiar with what it takes to, to get a good driver on the road from start to finish. I think they spent a lot of effort getting the women into the industry because it's so male dominant and they want it to be equal pretty much so they are spending a lot of advertisement and push campaigning to get it so it's very important to them to balance out the industry because we have a different way of driving than a male does. Anybody can do it just gotta put your mind to it that's all and be confident. Confidence behind the wheel is very important. When I went to a uh, trucking association, they, gave, they said uh, Bison was the best for um, learning. And then I um, got sponsorship by Bison. Did the 13 weeks additional training, which really helped me. It's beneficial to go to a bigger company. They have the money to keep the equipment safe compared to a smaller company. And they have uh, their reputation to up upheld compared to a small company. We've got the freight, we can keep our drivers moving and we're allowed to get a lot of customers because of our safety record and everything like that. Safety is number one, so Bison would be highly recommended for anybody that wants to be able to keep moving and support their family. You do what you want to do, you know, you can't tell somebody that you can't do it. It's just if you like to drive big things, then do it. You know, nobody else can tell you not to do it. The only person that's going to stop you from doing it is yourself. So it doesn't matter what society says. If you want to do it, then you do it.